R B dot fucking slow shit ever. And then um, stream starting at whatever time stuff like that. So that's that's all. That's the only reason I've got me out like that. Really, just um, just so there's something there actually doing something. In fact, this, I should change this really. Let us um, add in brick. Yeah, this one will do. Right. Um, normal. Right. Uh, what's the thing there? Rambling. Scroll. Normal. Why can I hear a cat fucking about behind desks? I've told you. No, don't come over fucking meow meow meow. I know exactly what you were doing. You were trying to get something on Claire's desk, weren't you? Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Sure up. You think... You think I'll just believe anything you say, don't you? You think I'll believe anything you say? I'm not buying it. That shit you're selling, I ain't buying. What? Sell your shit somewhere else. Don't you blink at me aggressively. Don't you blink at me. I'm gonna scruff up your fur. I'm gonna scruff up your fur. It's all fucking scruff now. Scruff, 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 scruff. That's right, shake your head, because I scruffed up your fur. You see, you just. I was busy doing something there, and you. Right, here we go. Oh, look what you've done now, you got it in the wrong place. What's this? You got the wrong place now, how do you? How come this. No, not that one, this one. No, what? Why is it. What's it doing? It's massive now. I mean, I know I am rambling pretty large, but not that large. How do you shrink it? Rumbling, rumbling, rumbling. That that, that actually see that that seems better. <laughs> that that's that's definitely more um more thing. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Unfortunately, it doesn't go any faster than that. That's a, that's as fast as a ramble as can go. Ramble, ramble, ramble. <laughs> but I'm gonna change it to that. Rumble, 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 rumble. <laughs> Put it down with normal speed, that's a little bit too fast, is that? There you go. There you go, it's not quite as insanely fast now. There we go. So there you go, guys, not too bad, not too bad overall. Bit of Skyrim, bit of Baldur's Gate with Claire and shit. Bit of random stream shite, that's not bad, that's not bad. Like I say, big thanks to um, everybody for showing up and stuff. Hope it was uh, at least somewhat entertaining. At least, at least somewhat. I'm a film job. At least, at least if it wasn't somewhat entertaining, I'm definitely failing. But I expect it was at least somewhat entertaining. Most for me, anyway. I, I, I'm actually really surprised. I think Skyrim was the uh, surprise for me. Like, I actually, I actually really fucking enjoyed it. It was really fucking good. And Baldur's Gate was um, really solid as well. More than expected. But then again, it's like I say, I, I should have I really, um, really expected it because I proper love co-op RPG. That's one of the reasons why Secret of Mana is so fucking... Um, so fun to me. I mean, any kind of RPG that's... I mean, I even mentioned about like Dark Alliance, didn't I? And... Um, Oh, it was the EverQuest one, no. I knew the name of the EverQuest game until... EverQuest? Oh man, I can't remember... I can't remember the name of the fucking game now. Champions of Norath, thank you. That's the one, Champions of Norath. God, that would piss me off, that. I can't remember the name. But yeah, I mean, any RPG... 
fucking cooperative, and I'm signed up, me, so Baldur's Gate's really solid as well. Any RPG that's co-op. Always good. Always good. So, OTG, how much have you been streaming lately? Oh, it's Sanguine Rose. How much have you been streaming recently? Well, tonight... No, sorry, tonight's not been the most I've streamed. But it was certainly the most organised, anyway. Most organised. I did a few. I did a couple of streams last week on Wednesday and Thursday, I think. But they were just test streams. I think one was six hours long and one was like six hours again or something like that. It might have been more than that, actually. It might have been six or seven each day. But, um... But yeah, they were just test runs and stuff like that, just to get set up for this week. Like I say, I'm going to um, run a fair few streams this week. And um, see how things go, you know, like, do a few bit more bits and bobs and stuff, and um, just get it all sorted out and stuff like that. I mean, I might not even announce it on YouTube tomorrow, I'm not sure. I just need to get a few more things set up first. I mean, I, I'd like to email Twitch, get these other resolutions down. Because it's really frustrating when you can stream in such a good resolution, and, you know, frame rate and everything. But the problem is the bit rate and the uh, the frame rate is too much for some PC. So it'd be nice if people could just like drop down the resolution, not go from 720p to 360p. That's naff, is that? So what am I supposed to do? Stream in 30 frames per second rather than 60? But I mean, I could do. I could stream in 30 frames per second rather than 60, and more people will be able to watch 720p then. But that's fucking lame, is that? That's fucking lame. Need to be 480 or 720, not 720 plus. I think the 720 plus is the 60 frames. I, th I think if I put it, I'm not sure. I'm, this, is, this, is what, this is what I'm saying. This is why I did two test runs last week, and this is why I'm still doing test runs this week. It, there's, a, there's a lot of extra shit involved. Most streamers don't do 60. Yeah, yeah, I know. It, what always stuck out to me is when I was browsing around streams and you do see a 60 frames per second stream and it's like, wow, that's fucking nice, is that? Nice. <laughs> I OTG, I feel really cheated. I watched a lot of Oz and there ain't as much dick in it as you promised. <laughs> oh, no. Believe me, there is more than enough dick in the overall of Oz. There is enough. Certainly, um, I think so anyway, there's more than enough dick. Plenty of it. Maybe not in season one. Now think about it, maybe not so much in season one, but believe me, there's enough. <laughs> Definitely. Start season three. <laughs> right in the middle of the dicks. Season one's not bad. Season two's really good. Um, season three's not bad. Season four's really good. Season 5 starts to cool down a little bit. Season 6 is not so great. But 1 to 4 is excellent. And 5's not too bad neither. But 1 to 4 is excellent. I think 1 could be a bit slow in the beginning as well. So, but it's not too bad. Especially if you're new to it, 1's fine. Uh, this, this, is, this is coming from somebody that's watched it like a million times over and over and over, by the way. So bear in mind, like... Like, say, I go by the rewatchability pretty much. Like, say, one's not as good as two. Like, season one's not as good as two, but that's only because I've watched them a million fucking times to flat. They're all good. Six is the weak link of the lot, definitely. Six, they, I don't think they expected to end it. Like, the last episode of season six has, um... It's an hour and a half episode. It's almost like they did a regular one hour episode. If you watch it, it's like nothing special happens for the entire hour, really. Nothing. And I'm not I'm not spoiling anything. Yeah, don't 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 worry. I'm not spoiling. Don't worry. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm not going to spoil anything. No spoilers. But um, it's like I say, it's just like a regular episode for the entire hour, and then it's just got this extra fucking half an hour bolted onto it, like a really um, like oh shit, this is the last episode we're doing. We need to end it or something like that. And I think the Don's been better off than. I mean, it's not like it's a bad ending. It's just it's just a really abrupt end. It's just a really abrupt end to the um, to the overall. It just, it doesn't have the quality that the entire overall all the seasons had. It just doesn't have the quality to it. That's all I'm saying. 
<laughs> Spoiler, some of them are criminals. See you, dude. Although I should probably get out of the habit of saying bye when folks say bye, because, <laughs> you know, if everybody did that, like, it's fucking... 400 people, everybody's gonna go, right, bye, I'm gonna get OTG to say bye to <laughs> It's like, oh, see you, dude, see you, dude, see you, dude, see you, dude. <laughs> I like to be polite, though, especially if, like, I'm around and I know, if I notice somebody say, yeah, like, here we go, like, hey, OTG, bye. <laughs> it's more on the lines, if, I'm not, if it, I don't always see the stream chat and stuff like that, but if I do see it, it's, um, it feels polite to say bye. <laughs> I think somebody said, do I watch, um, here we go, or did you, do you watch any Let's Players? I've got to be honest, I don't. Not really. I am subscribed to a couple of Let's Players, but I don't actually watch that much Let's Players. And it's not a case of like, well, I watch all my own stuff. I just, I don't watch, I don't watch my own stuff and I, I don't watch um, other folks' um, Let's Players, really. I think the, f the, the main reason I don't watch other folks is um, it could be a game that I have to play yet. And obviously, I don't want anything spoiling for myself. And secondly, um, you can be really, really influenced by what... Obviously, like, with anything, you can be easily influenced by what people say or write and stuff. So, I don't want to... Watch somebody playing something and have a reaction to something. And then have that reaction influence my reaction when I come around playing it. So... I like to stay pure. Let's say uh, you gotta stay pure. So that's the only that's that's the only reason. But yeah, like I say, I mean, I'm subscribed to a couple of playthroughs, um, like Chrono Gear and um, a, f a couple of others and stuff like that. But I, I do watch them from time to time. But it depends on the game that they're doing stuff like like um, like Chrono's um, Dark Souls. I'll um, I watch Chrono's Dark Souls video. I watch quite a few of Qu uh, Chrono's Dark Souls videos. Mainly because the guy's really fucking good at Dark Souls. But, like, say he was, say he was playing, um, I don't know, like, fucking Skyrim at the moment, or something like that. Obviously, I won't watch that. It's like, say, I just, I just don't want stuff spoiling. You know, like, I mean, like I say, it's the internet, spoilers are around everywhere. But at the same time, if I'm just randomly sat somewhere and somebody does a spoiler for a game, that's one thing. If I, like, I don't want Skyrim spoiling for myself and then go watch a Skyrim video, that's just being fucking dumb. So... Obviously, I don't watch. Uh, I don't watch anything that I, I was going to play myself, and like I say, that's because I don't want the story spoiling, and secondly, because I don't want the reactions spoiling. Very easy to, um, like I say, just to like somebody's got a reaction to something, and it, it obviously it can influence your reaction. You might have a completely different reaction, or you might have a reaction based on you know how they acted and stuff like that. You might subconsciously even and stuff like that. you might not even realise, and I, I don't. I ain't gonna take that risk. I don't like them. I don't like the mods. So I don't. I don't watch them. I don't watch any. Not really. Except unless it's something I've I've played a lot or I never intend to play. Like Dark Souls is obviously fine. I played a shit ton of that. And um, what was um, somebody else's thing I was watching a while back? I can't remember what it was. I can't remember what it was. Are you part of the TGS OTG? I'm indeed. Tejas is my um, my network partner. It's a bit daft though, isn't it? I, I mean, like on Twitch and stuff like that, you're quite fine to play games and you know stream them and do whatever and stuff like that. That's absolutely fine. It's all archived and stuff like that, so people can watch it later on. But on YouTube, you need to go through a network. Otherwise, you can't be a partner. It's like, oh, uh, okay. It, it's it's like it's like basically YouTube set it up so some people are going to be making money. It's I mean I don't I don't really understand it, but it's 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 all right. It's all right. I mean, it, it, it is quite nice, really, because, like I say, you've, you've always, you always know, like, if you ever have a problem on YouTube, you could go and talk to somebody at TGS, and they could go and talk to somebody at YouTube. So, on that front, it's kind of like having a, um, an agent. Like, TGS is kind of like your agent, but, you know, they don't find your work. But they do, in a way. They find your adverts. 
and stuff like that. So it it, it, it works out all right. It works out all right. YouTube gets you. Oh, <laughs> gets the YouTube network. Moves to Twitch. <laughs> No, I'm not moving anywhere. It literally is a dual wheel between um, between YouTube and stream. I've just been a bit busy lately, and then there's been this and then that, and then I have been enjoying doing the stream stuff like that. But on a normal week, there'll be videos, at least um, two videos a day, and there'll also be the streams as well. My current plan is there'll be a video at 6 o'clock at night, then at 7 o'clock at night, there'll be a stream for two hours. And then at nine o'clock, there'll be a video. And then at 10 o'clock, I'll stream for two hours. That's the rough plan at the moment. If all goes to plan, that's the rough plan. We'll see how it goes though. So basically a couple of hours of um, video each day and at least a couple of hours of stream each day. So it's like, it's, but that's a lot of time, isn't it? That's a lot of time. I mean, most folk watching my shit will be able to watch that amount of content out of me. Let alone fucking other people's content they're watching and everything else like that. So, it remains to be seen. It is a hell of a lot of time. But saying that, the videos on YouTube, they don't go anywhere. You can always watch them at a later date. And the, um... The streams... Well, the, uh, the entire point of the stream is it's live. I know you can go back and watch it later on, but the fun is being on the stream chat and, you know, seeing the shit live and stuff like that. So... You know, it's a different beast entirely. I mean, some folk will only watch videos. Some folk will only watch streams and only a little bit of videos. Some folk will watch a bit of both and be balanced. P people, people are big enough to figure it out themselves. They'll, they'll, they'll figure out what they like. They don't need me to fucking say, oh, well, I think you should watch. And you know what I think you should do? I think at six o'clock when my new video goes up, you should watch that for an hour. And then at seven o'clock when that video's ended, you should go into the stream for two hours until nine o'clock, at which point there's now a video on YouTube, another new video, and you should watch that for an hour, and then when that's finished at ten o'clock, you should come back to the stream for two hours. <laughs> Why don't I just suck six hours of your fucking time every day? <laughs> that is a fucking time vampire setup as that, man. <laughs> but... The... Uh, but the, um... Like I say, the YouTube videos don't go anywhere. Two hours a day on YouTube, it's not going anywhere. It could be more than two hours a day as well. It just depends. I might do three hours a day on YouTube and just two hours stream. Two hours on YouTube, four hours stream. It, it really just does depend. It really does depend. Like I say, all the, all the mechanics are in place at the moment. It's just a matter of letting them run now and see, see what sticks and what don't. See what I like and what I don't. Don't get burned out though. I, I've got to be honest. I just, you know, I just don't feel the burn anymore. It, it's, 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 it's fucking weird. Like for the longest of time, like it must have been about a year and a half. You'd always feel this burn still, like, you know, at the back of your mind. And it got to this year, and I, I, I honestly haven't felt it fucking once this year now. I ain't felt it once. Are you going to be streaming at a set time? Yes, there will be set times. Once, in the same way that the video, videos are scheduled and at set times, the streams will also be scheduled and at set times. And this is why I was saying a stream at like 7 till 9 for the, for the European lot and a stream at 10 till 12 for the American lot. It's still a little bit early for the American lot, it's 10 till 12. But I can't do too late, obviously, because I need to retain a decent sleep pattern. I know it's a bit fun now because it's 4 o'clock in the morning. But, you know, it's, um, it should be a bit better than that. I should be going to bed fucking a couple of hours ago at the latest, but we get carried away on stream. Do a 24-hour stream special. You know what? Maybe at some point I can do 24 hours. I can do, I bet you a 10, I could do fucking 24 hours. I've done 24 hours at poker. I've done over 24 hours doing fuck all. I can do 24 hours. So can I still watch the second stream even though I'm European? No! No! You have, you add your stream at 7 till 9 o'clock. It, it's the Americans fucking that get the 10 to a 12 o'clock. You can't have that one. I'm greedy. You can only have one. Some folk, man. Some folk. They're not happy with that two hours of Skyrim. No, they've got to tune into the Americans' two hours of Baldur's Gate and stuff like that. 
Poker stream. The thing is, I could probably do a poker stream pretty easy now. I don't have to worry about, like, I mean, I never really have to worry about anybody sitting down at the table anywhere. But, you know, you can just put a stream delay of, like, five minutes. Put a stream delay on it. Which is a bit naff for talking to folk, but... It, it does make it a bit better. You don't want people fucking looking at your cards. And there's no hand that goes over five minutes long. I don't think anybody's going to sit down at your table. Especially, oh, you know, the easiest way to do it. Fucking sit down at uh, multi-table tournaments. Uh, sorry, not multi- Well, you could do an MTT. But even do an MTT or a single table tournament. And then the, the table's locked in on it. So, join, a, join an STT. Where it's at about eight out of ten or something like that. And then um, you probably got no chance of anybody jumping on. Any plans for more collab videos with any other YouTubers? Um, not at the moment, no. Um, I, I could have done, but I've had to turn a couple of foot down, and it's purely because of time restraints. I mean, I've got a lot of shit to do anyway, and then, you know, with, um... It, it's just, like, with the, with the video plans I've got, and all the streaming plans, and everything else, and, you know, like, day-to-day -day shit, it, it's just too much. You know, I, I am but one man. I am but one man. I've only got so many hours in the day. And when I want to record so much, like, I want to record, like, four or five hours a day. And that nowadays I want to stream as well. So say I recorded, like, even just say an average day of about four hours that I record. And then I go and do about four hours of streaming, which is probably looking about an average as well. That's eight hours just on stream. Um, just on stream and video. Then you need to edit the videos. I need to go around replying to comments on videos, Twitter, Facebook. I need to uh, send emails to folk and reply to emails from fucking folk. Uh, I need to actually. I mean, sometimes I actually need to do real life shit. Amazingly enough, I need to do some fucking you know, stuff around house and shit like that, or go out. She just shit me up. You just shit me up. Just saw this fucking cat head from around the curtains. Like, what the fuck was that? You just fucking shit me off from the other side of the room there, what was that? You made me jump. You. Go and make a horror game. Bloody cat. Make an horror game. Make an horror game, you're that scary. Make one. Make an horror game. You're gonna start your own cat in the studio. Hey? You're gonna call it Cashy Pew Productions? Or you're gonna call it Pew Productions? Productions, because she goes pew. Kishi, what are you doing? Oh, your sister's down here. Meow. Yeah, your sister's down here. Sleeping next to my Xbox pad, aren't you? Don't look at me. That's not my fluff flying around the room. That's yours. How far is the kitty cam coming? It'll be the end of the month. Give it another week, guys. Another week. Or so. And, um... When GameStation pays me, that's when um, kitty cam comes up. <laughs> it should be pretty alright, actually. Like I say, I've already got all the camera and all the other shit like that set up for it, so I, just need, I literally just need um, a couple of wires. And, um... Bit of a play around and should be able to get a nice little cat cam going. Is there a cat on there at the moment? No. Like I said, I'm just going to have it in the corner of my room, pointing at their, um, the tower. And while I'm streaming, I have the fucking cat cam going, why not? I mean, not all the time when I'm playing games, obviously, and stuff like that, but, you know. Have the game on one scene, have the game and cat cam on another scene. You know, switch between the two. Where did you get the name over the gun? Ah, somebody mentioned something about a gun shop. God, you people have got some damn good memory. You people got some good memory. I can't believe you can remember that I said I used to live above a gun shop when I was a kid. That's, um, that's good memory, sir. But I actually got my, um, it's, it's actually, it's not related to the, um, the gun shop. It's, um, I listened to your TG. Would, thank you, dude, thank you. That's, that's what surprises me. <laughs> that, that's why, that's why I'm surprised. The folk actually fucking listened. And, um... It's from poker. Yeah, Pink Fox is, um, is on it here. It's from poker. It's... If you sit down at a six-player table, there'll be there's six positions. 
there's the uh, the dealer button then there's um, the small blind then there's the big blind so that's position one two three big um, dealer button small blind big blind then you've got under the gun it's position four position five has no name and position six is last position so you've got uh, there's, there's, there's five name positions, like you've got the, the dealer button, small blind, big blind, under the gun, and last, last to act. But there is no, there is no, um, no name for the fifth seat. It's dealer button, small blind, big blind, under the gun, blank, last to act. So, in my infinite wit... I um I, I coined under the gun. So you've got big blind, small blind. Uh, sorry, um, dealer button, small blind, big blind, under the gun, over the gun, last to act. And like I, I know it, it's the height of wit. I, I agree, but like I said, that, that's I, I coined that fucking term just fucking about, and um, started using it as an handle then. In an FPS game, you look over the gun, so it's fitting. It is indeed. It's fitting on quite a few levels. It's fit on quite a few levels. Bit of a mouthful of a, as a full name and stuff like that. However, when I when I made that name, I didn't expect that years down the line I'd have a YouTube called that and everything like that, you know. But I'm not like I'm bored anyway. I like my name. It's all right. Like I say, it's just a bit of a mouthful. But it does have a, it does have a nice short down. It does have a nice acronym for it. So. Didn't you also use fusion or something? I did. That was um, that was my handle from my Lampard days. Long, long time ago. Long, long time ago. There's only been um, there's only been a few names that I've used a lot. But I used to I used to go through loads of names, loads and loads of fucking names. Back in early days of internet, one of the best things I liked about it was the fact that you could just fucking change your name all the time, couldn't you? One day you're this name, another day you're this different nickname. Fucking great. Very cool. I think my stream chat's lagged out. Oh no, it's there. Was the Doom 3 Tony the last time you used um, that name? I think it was about that time, you know. I think it was roughly around that, that day and stuff like that. I'm not sure. I think it was, was it definitely um, pre-YouTube? Or it was very, it was before I had an account on YouTube, definitely. Must have been. Must have been, I can't remember. Were you ever a peg boy? The hell is a peg boy? It doesn't sound good. It sounds like the cousin of the rent boy, but I, I don't know what a peg boy is. Lol, he means the name peg boy. Oh, were you ever peg boy? <laughs> no, 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 I don't think I ever was peg boy. <laughs> Work the peg leg boy. That's kind of the image I had in my mind there as well. A peg boy was a young man kept on pirate ships by pirates. <laughs> How random is this? How fucking random is this? So fucking random. Where did that even come from, peg boy? This young man was forced to sit on a large wooden peg all the time. Anyway, this was done so that whenever a pirate wanted to drop his anchor, so to speak, he'd have no problem. What? The, the young man was forced to sit on a large wooden peg all the time. So this was... Anyway, this was done so that whenever a pirate wanted to drop his anchor, he'd have no problem. You see... Drop his anchor. I I can't. That just that, that does not seem right here. Does not seem fucking right. No, he's not fucking a small boy that sits on a peg all day long. No, so no. No, this is just wrong. It, 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 no, th this is getting like holes. No, 
uh, no, they, they did not have a boy sit on a peg. So, so it was wide enough 